Mindanao Tako, Lunga, Kinidwa ka grupo, should respect not only the law, but also respect the judicial. Ang status sa kaso, ang TRO, is good for 60 days. And we have filed yesterday our memorandum in support of our prayer for the issuance of a writ of preliminary injunction. Now, kay kinimungong temporary restraining order is time-bound. And what we're asking is to convert the TRO to make it into an injunction. An injunction. Now, why why are we doing this now? Ang DILG o Ombudsman, ko may inunta atong question dito sa atong petition as 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 a court of appeals, no? We question the implementation by the DILG of the decision rendered by the Ombudsman. Now, and in that TRO that the Court of Appeals has issued, the Court of Appeals directed both the DILG and the Ombudsman to submit within five days their comment on the petition that we have filed. Now, that was November. Now, what happened was the ALG asked for an extension of 30 days from, I think, November 13th to up to December 13th. Ang Ombudsman also asked for 30 days extension, i.e. from this November 16th or 20, November uh, uh, 20 to December 20th. And uh, we have received uh, recently uh, copies of resolutions issued by the Court of Appeals respectively granting the request of the ALG and the Ombudsman for the 30-day extension. So, mo ka na nga wala pa sila yung comment nga na-file dito sa petition that we have filed with the Court of Appeals. So, in the meantime, ang 60-day period is about to expire. Lisod man nga tatagihig, pangayon nila nga extension, mo yun o ay magamit yun noon in order to to allow the TRO to simply lapse, no, without action on the part of the Court of Appeals. Now nga we have filed our memorandum asking for the extension. Okay, di pa man ma kwan, di pa man ma ma deliberate sa Court of Appeals kaya wala ko may comment ang ang DILG o ang Guzman. So there's nothing dili ni inun nga atong atong salak or atong the reason for the delay is our own action or inaction. Kanang Blue Certification Award, that's an award issued by the Ombudsman. Level two, level two. Actually, to look at levels, level three, level two, level one. Level three is the highest. Wala pa yung siyudad nga nakaabot sa level 3. Ang nakaabot sa level 2, tuloro ka siyudad. Cagayan, Iloilo, at Makati. And Cagayan was number 1, followed by Iloilo at Makati. Na ay mga level 1. Pero dagahan mga siyudad nga wala gani makaabot sa level 1. Muni, level 2. And hindi siya particularly sa atong treasury, sa finance department. Now, and part of the award, uh, uh, part of the reason for the award was the increased revenue. Okay, okay an increased collection had uh, contributed to the high score of the city.